Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today's topic is about uh, uh, limitation in deploying virtual machine in Azure free trial subscription. Uh, I have created this uh, free trial subscription few weeks before uh, to create a series of demo videos. Uh, but during uh, the uh, video creation process, uh, I have faced a lot of technical challenges. One of the challenges uh, two days before I have posted is about uh, a challenge in creating a VNet. And uh, after the research, I found uh, we have to register the uh, provider uh, in subscription to deploy the virtual network. Similarly, uh, for a VM deployment, I was navigating the configuration wizard one by one to populate the VM configurations. In that particular section called disk, I am not able to enter the disk details uh, from the drop down because the drop down looks empty and it's a mandatory field. I am not able to navigate to the next level because of this empty field. And uh, when I was going through this whole uh, uh, troubleshooting process, uh, I remember like a couple of days before I have registered a, a network resource provider. Similarly, I was checking on whether the compute services got registered or not. So then I found uh, Microsoft at compute uh, as a resource provider is not registered in the subscription level. So then i navigate to the subscription settings and uh, select the appropriate resource provider and uh, registered my microsoft dot uh, compute uh, services from the subscription and also i gone through the other service pro uh, providers like uh, monitoring and um, key vault uh, storage and uh, similarly what are the mandatory uh, services which i need to register for upcoming demos i register all the services and then uh, uh, navigated back to the configuration wizard now i'm able to complete the configuration uh, without any issues and now i'm able to deploy the virtual machines after deploying the virtual machines i have enabled the bastion services and uh, while enabling the bastion services it created a subnet automatically if you look on um, uh, vnet section and in the subnet you can see azure bastion uh, subnets got created and uh, in the virtual machine uh, blade uh, you can select the bastion and uh, uh, try to put the username and password uh, what you have configured during the vm deployment now i think you can uh, take an rdp of those virtual machines why i have created this video in a microsoft free trial subscription most of the Microsoft resource providers are not registered properly. Uh, it's in not registered mode. So whenever you have signed up for a free trial subscription, please go ahead to the subscription and uh, look on the resource provider settings and uh, search through all the uh, resource providers which are mandatory for your uh, POS related work or demo related work and register it and then proceed for the deployment.